Protestants believe we have no need for a magisterium, a living teaching authority, since, as they say, the Holy Spirit will teach us the truth of God's Word. 1 John 2.27 is usually their go-to text, quote, You have no need that anyone should teach you, as his anointing, that is the Holy Spirit, teaches you about everything, close quote. Is John teaching the Protestant doctrine of the inner testimony of the Spirit and denying the need for a magisterium? Absolutely not. We know John can't be rejecting a living teaching authority because two chapters later, in 1 John chapter 4, verse 6, he instructs his readers that listening to the apostles is the criterion for discerning the spirit of truth from the spirit of error. He writes, quote, Whoever knows God listens to us, and he who is not of God does not listen to us. By this we know the spirit of truth and the spirit of error, close quote. Notice, union with God is contingent on obedience to the living teaching authority. So, if John is not affirming the Protestant idea that all we need to know God's truth is the testimony of the Spirit, well, then what does he mean? The context reveals that John is warning his readers against false teachers. In 1 John 2.19, he writes, Some went out from us, but they were not of us. If there are false teachers... Well, then that implies there are true teachers that Christians ought to listen to. The Spirit, or the anointing, teaches Christians the truth, but through the living teaching authority, and not apart from it. If you want to learn more about this topic and others like it, visit our website at catholic.com. For Catholic Answers, I'm Carlo Broussard. Thanks for watching.